what's going on guys and welcome to the newest challenge series and this one is going to be the stolen bases challenge there is a way in this game to practice stealing bases for points and stuff and you can like you can see how many points you get so i'm going to be taking some of the top base stealers of all time putting them through this challenge we're making them go against the same catcher all of them and that is going to be russell martin of the blue jays they're all going to be going against russell martin and we are going to see who can get the highest score. So we'll start off with five guys. The top three will move on and compete where we crown a winner. And yeah, that's pretty much how the series is going to go. Here we go. We get 15 chances for each. Okay, Estrada. And we're all going against Estrada. Okay, I should be there right there. It's not actually, I'm not 100% sure it's going to be uh, going to be Russell Martin just because I do have the legend roster. So I wasn't 100% sure here. I'm going to wait for it. Wait for it. Go Estrada. Come on, Estrada. Yes. That was a decent job. I might be gunned right there, though. I might be gunned. Oh, no. Kaj stealing on an aggressive lead. Okay, I'm going to get that nice little lean going. He's going to throw back soon. I know it. He's going to throw one of these times. He's taking a long time. Okay, we should have it there. That was a pretty good jump. Henderson should be there. There we go. There we go, Ricky Henderson. He was kind of a disappointment in uh, inside the park home run challenge. So hopefully he can get this one. He can do better here. There's a how good 0.34 second jump and we are gone caught stealing. So we have a score of 600 right now. Do I go for the super aggressive lead? Back one lean. I gotta have a good job as soon as I see that leg. As soon as I see that leg, there we go. 0.33 seconds and I am there by a mile. We gotta use it. They considered it a dangerous lead and a good jump. That should get you a stolen base pretty much every time, especially with a guy like Ricky Henderson. Okay, let's go. Come on. There we go. Good jump. Definitely a good jump. So yeah, I think to make it fair, it's, it's all got to be against the same pitcher. And by the end of this, we'll know who the greatest base dealer of all time is, J judging by who has the best score. Oh, 0 0.35 second jump, and Henderson is there again. I love the swag this guy has. He's so sick. Like I wish I wish I could watch this guy play or something because he seems pretty like a pretty sweet dude. There we go. 0 0.36 second jump, and we are there. Okay, so now we have what 1,575. And let's see. Wait, is he gonna throw back? Oh no! I got, I got, I got gunned. Why did the? What is going on? Why did the? Why did the guy just stand there? And why did it not let me go back? Oh, this game sometimes, you guys. This game just drives me crazy. Grab the leg. There we go, Estrada. 0.35 second jump, and we are there. Nice stolen base. I wish there was an option to steal second and third. Honestly, I think that would make it a lot funner. Okay, five chances remaining. Got the lean back. Oh, that I, I'm I'm screwed right here. That was a 0.55 second jump, and we still get it. That two in a row will jump me up to 2,350. There's a nice get back. I like that. Let's see. Come on, Estrada. Pitch the ball. Pitch the ball. 0.37 seconds, and we are now at a gold 2,400, 2,700 points. We got now. Oh no, I'm I'm toast. Get on the bag. Why does that keep happening? I am so confused at why that keeps happening. Because I am not moving backwards. I think that might be a little, uh, little, what's it called, Easter egg in the game. The fact that it does that. Okay, lift up your leg. Lift up your leg. There we go. We're gone. Definitely a stolen base right there. Okay, we got one chance remaining. Can we get another one? Oh, and we're back. That was our last chance, though. 2,925k. Let's see. Come on, Estrada. Give me a nice slow release, man. Slow release. There we go. Should have it. Should have it. There's no way he's got me. Yes, there we go. So we end off with Ricky Henderson. The tough score to beat to start off the thing. He had good jump, good jump, okay jump. And he, he ends with a score of 3,250. If you guys enjoyed this and you're excited for the next episode, because we're going to find out by the end who the best, best stealer is best base stealer is and yeah i'll see you guys in the next episode